excuse me, Tweety. Tweety said, no, you move. What are you doing, Sarah? Sarah, girl. We have um, one, two, three, four boxes, a letter, and a card, and a postcard. Uh, so, Carolina Ash, you on them? Angie, I'm probably right in your way. Let me move. Oh, I guess I can't move that back. Okay. This, this one says, this is kind of interesting, a world of pups and pets. And let me check my emails to see if I might have a email that says that. I don't, I don't think I do, though. Um, I don't think I do. Anybody know who this one's from yet? Yeah, please remember to vote. Vote, vote, vote. Please, please, please. Seeing if it was an Amazon one. That's one of the new ones that goes in that room. In that one right back there, Angie, straight back, that orange one. Um, it just went to the left. Ooh. Oh, you know, Angie, that eerie, or look at how he's walking. Did you notice that when you found him? No. He's got a bad leg. Jackie and volunteers looking for looking after these cats so well. For those hungry kitties from Trisha slash UK, uh, Amber Fizz and her four cats, Amber, Fizz, Pixie, and Tess. Enjoy. So it's from Trisha from the UK, and her cam name is Amber Fizz. So your kitties' names are Amber, Fizz, and that's F-I-Z-Z, -Z, Carolina. Pixie, P-I-X-I, -I, and Tess. And uh, it's a note from Miss P. Miss P. Oh, are you okay? Are you okay? Um, yes. Yeah. I had to check for the N under the tail. <laughs> we got a, a, a case of Friskies, and these are the fillets. I always say, well, the kitties like those fillets, but they like everything. Fillets, the little bits, the pâtés, the gravy. They love it all. Thank you. Thank you very, very much. That's Trisha from UK. And you know we love these, those springs. I do send one of these home um, with every single kitty. Uh, I'm going to put this in the closet for right now because we're going to do um, a, oh sugar palm I didn't reach it back enough come on now you got yeah go down there and clean it up yeah go on down there Nebraska I was going to try to catch that up on the floor yeah we're going to work on adoption base tomorrow so we'll use these I'll put that there and we have oh these look like treaties Watch yourself, Tilo. Tilo says, are you sure there isn't anything special just for me? Tilo likes those plastic toys. Oh, and, oh, this is green. We haven't gotten the green ones yet. There's two two cases of um, the Seafood Temptations. Thank you. The kitties do like these. They, they love the, the Temptations and the, and the Whiskas. And the craze. And this is why the box is a little heavy. 
he also got a box of Armor Hammer. And I think I'm going to just go ahead and open, take this off because I'm going to have to use it tomorrow morning after, when I, after I scoop for breakfast. I know some of them were getting a little low. Oh, I think we'll leave it in that because I see one little corner has got a little leakage. So I'm just going to leave it in that and I'm going to use that tomorrow morning. And that's a 14, let me check. Yeah, it's a 14 pound bag of Arm & Hammer. Thank you so much. That's one. Yeah. Oh, Octavia, you're a nut. Thank you, Trisha. I appreciate your help. I really do. Um, gold and white, and then uh, nope. A lot of gold smoker. Okay. He's got black in his ears, Angie. I marked his ears so we can make sure we know these guys. So we know their personalities better. Okay, box coming over. And then the other one's paper and white. Yes, and that one is a little shy. So um you guys is this him up here in the Yes. Okay, yeah. They're all in the five. Yep. Yeah. Two gold. One gold and white, one tiger white, and one calico. Was the calico in there too, Angie? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, you got it. Two guys. Um, six. Oh, five now because of the gone. Okay. Yep. Oh, I, I need to change my notes on that. We got, this is one I was expecting. It's box one and box two. And I think I was supposed to open box one up for a note because I did get an email on this. And these were mailed November 13th. Oh, no, no, no. I taught, I emailed her on November 13th or she emailed me asking about used toys and beds and we responded that yes, yes, yes. And this is from Janet and her sister Lori. And they have cats, Toby, Harley, Walter and Petey. Toby, Harley, Walter and Petey. I always like to hear you guys' kitties' names. So let's see here. I'm gonna cut. You know, Steve, remember when he cut his finger really bad? What was that, like two weeks ago? Um, Saturday night, which is pretty good now. Saturday night, uh, Karen and her three girls were here, and we were busily working in the kitchen, which is, you know how bad I hate paperwork? I hate cooking even more. <laughs> I'll do it, but I don't like it. But Kirsten, the middle one, was cutting up with scissors a bunch of bread for me so I could make dressing, and she was cutting away and sliced her finger probably two-thirds of the way around her her pointer finger. So we had to put series strips on that also. Like you guys be careful. Ooh. Your letter. Oh my golly. Wow. These are cool. We've had these before. These are really cool. There's bunches of toys in these. There's balls and catnips and toys on on sticks and there's a Santa Claus and a snowman. There are two um, toy socks, Christmas socks. Thank you. These are really cool. Oh, I see something else I like. So this is from Janet and Lori. Uh, boy, I can't wait to pull this one thing out. Um, I'm the, remember how I'm the post-it nut, post-it nut, post-it note queen? I'm also a tape person. I use tape on everything. Thank you. I will use that a whole lot. Whoops, you got to be careful. And here is a bag that these toys were, were never played with. Oh, my goodness. We're going to do adoption bags tomorrow. You know how we always make up adoption bags? So you guys have all seen those bags go out with the adoptions. And they're just chock full of all different things, including toys. So 
we'll use some of these for that tomorrow. And you pick the ray, you guys. You have your snackers. Hey, what are you doing over there? Oh, look what I found. <laughs> I know where these are going, and I know where this is going. <laughs> I'll share with you. And check this out. These are cool. Oh, my word. Janet and Lori, your kitty's going to play with these? They're going to want to play with them? you got to see what else is in here. And a really great bag. Oh, my gosh. This box is endless. We got a card. We got to read. We're supposed to always read the cards first. But. Hey, what do you guys do? And another one of these. I can't believe your kitties wouldn't love these. These are the kind of be beds that Bella loves these. Well, they all love these. These are great. Wow. Isn't that awesome? These are really, really nice beds. I'm going to stick them over here for a minute. Wow. Gosh, I'm sorry your kitties don't like them, but I'm sure glad, too. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, these kitties are going to love this. Look at that. So it's like a hammock. Here, let's read this note. You guys, let's, let's put this right here for right now. Then it'll be on the cam when I move. Here, we'll put this down here. Oh, it's okay, Kiki. Oh, my goodness. Oh, hey, check this out. And a free coupon for a 14-pound box of uh, Fresh Steps. You know, I keep telling you all that we collect those um, points from Fresh Step. This is what they send me. You send in so many points, and they send a free ticket then for a 14-pound box of uh, litter. Thank you. And a, and a check. Thank you, Jana. Thank you. Oh, let's read this. Hi, Jackie, kitties, and volunteers. I had a long... <laughs> I love this. I had a long talk with Toby and Harley... And we discussed donating some of their toys to kitties that do not have forever homes and be oh, and may be less fortunate than they are. At first, they stared at me with a look of shock, but then they thought it was a good idea. Oh, <laughs> oh Emmeline is already in that sack. She, she fell off the thing, though. She fell off with it. Well, yeah, she doesn't look inside. <laughs> too worse for wear. You okay, Emmy? However, they also insisted that if they give up some of their toys, that I had to give something to. So, here is a check to be used toward the new floor. Yes. Or any medical expenses that you have at the center. Cool. Well, that'll, I have to, we need both, so I'll have to think about that one. Uh, they didn't think it was quite fair that they were giving up so much, and all I was giving was a piece of paper. And But they decided it was okay since I was giving something. <laughs> Thank you, Toby and Harley. Then they thought it would be a good idea if they asked my sister's kitties, Walter and Petey, if they would want to do the same. Walter and Petey thought it was a good idea, too, but only if Petey could supervise what was being given. So these two boxes are from Toby, Harley, Walter, and Petey. They were kind of embarrassed that the toys were not brand new, but I promised them that the next shipment we made to FFRC... Not sure when it will be, but probably after Christmas will not be used toys. It would be it would be new toys, food, treats, and other miscellaneous items that either of the kitties or you can use. Hey, trust me, good. Uh, these these beds are wonderful. Uh, we don't mind use things at all. None of the kitties oh. were too upset to see their carriers go to you. They thought that now they don't have to go to that that vet place. Little do they know they are getting new ones because they have kind of outgrown these. There are some beds, too, which they won't even miss because they wouldn't use them. Boy, sorry, Toby, Harley, Walter, and Petey. Your loss is definitely our gain on those beds. The kitties don't know this, but I took a few bags of their treats and included them, too. Even a small bag of treats for you, Jackie. Thank you. I hope you and the kitties enjoy the contents of the two boxes. Any of the contents can be used for either the center or Kitty City. Yeah, we probably ought to share one of the beds with Kitty City. 
Um, my sister and I both enjoy, enjoy watching the webcam and appreciate all you do for the kitties. We only wish more people would treasure kitties the way you do. Oh, uh, yeah, I, I know. And you, but I know you webcammers do too. We hope you have a wonderful holiday season. So it's from Jana and her two kitties, Toby and Harley, and Lori uh, from Walter and Walter and Petey. And they're both from Dyersville, Iowa. Thank you. And I think we have some some pictures. I'm going to put this in my pocket because we do have a few kitties that eat paper. Okay, check this out. This one is Toby. He's five years old. He's, he is a honk, isn't he? A honk of cuteness. This is Harley. Harley's a very cute guy also. He's five years old. Oh, here's one of my favorite colors. Petey. He's going to be six years old in December. Isn't he a good looking boy? <gasps> oh, and Walter, who is 11 years old. You know, your Walter looks a lot like my Missy, who's like 12. And she's my, don't tell anybody, but she's my favorite kitty in the whole wide world. Looks a lot like Walter. Thank you, guys. This is awesome. Well, let's get their other box out and we'll open that, too. And I will post that letter up from the kitty. That's pretty cool. Whoops. Okay. Let's put this box. Yeah, we're going to do this. Oh, it's so hard to keep organized. Watch out. Hey, are you brother Z? Uh-oh. Oh, there it is. Okay. So this is the second box. Oh, come on. Oh my gosh. Look at these. These are all toys. These are slightly used. And these are slightly used. These are, wow, boy. I do kitties have a lot of toys too. Wow. These are really great toys. Thank you. There's a there's some really cool toys. They're all good toys. Thank you. This is really, really nice. Our kitties, you know, they love their toys, but they're so rough on them. Oh, oh. this is pet stages. Have you guys heard of these? I think this is what I think it is, is where you put this down on the floor. And the, I don't know if you can see the light shining up on there. That it drives them crazy, which is what we like to do with kitties. It's just a mat that you put on the floor. And, uh, yeah, they blink. Yeah, that's it. it oh, it's an off and on here. I'm a, is Jane, hi, Janie. Hi. Oh, she needs, she needs a haircut so bad. She should be like that. <laughs> yeah. I bet it's a motion thing that it'll go off. Yeah, these are cool. Well, I'll put this out for um, the playground tonight. You guys are going to like it. I do think so. I'll keep a track on it. Make sure it turns off by itself. Oh, man. Look at this. Boy, you do. You, I love this. You take, You really do have fun with your kids. This might be a fun thing to add to that. We will put, we'll make sure that gets out for the kitties. That looks like a cool thing. And, oh, a nice brush. That's a great brush. Uh-oh. Is everybody okay? You're right. And what are these? Oh, we had some of these a long time ago until so they, they just weren't, we couldn't use them anymore. These are called those um, rolling snack balls, and you put, oh gosh, this one even comes with the snackers. These, these are pretty cool. Does this one open? There's different variations of these. The snacks go inside this, and then if the kitties uh, roll it around, the snacks fall out. Yeah, we've had a few of these, and the cats do like them. 
You know, I still think everybody that do, does, all manufacturers that does kitty toys needs to let us test them first because if they're going to last, um, our cats would our cats would give it a good test because there's some things that they say will last forever and they don't. So here's the crate. Oh my gosh, there's three of them. And you didn't, oh yeah, you need to get bigger ones. Wow. Oh, there's four of them. Sheesh. Look at this. Thank you. These are really nice. Look at that. There's two of them. This still has the tag on it. And these are still in their, their little thing. Portable. Oh, that's in French. There we go. Soft-sided carriers. Take your pet wherever you go in safety and comfort. These are nice. Thank you. That's really, really nice. You know, we use the crates, and I always feel better when I have quite a few of them out there. We, we have one shed where we store um, as many of these that we can get um, because... Um, just in case there would be like a fire or an emergency that we had to evacuate quick, uh, we would have some of the crates, or quite a few of the crates, um, to put the kitties in. So thank you. These are really nice and they don't take up very much space. Wow. So Janet and Lori, thank you. Thank you very, very much. That was a, that was a really cool haul. Okay guys, we're going to put these over here. Wow, you guys are lucky. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me. <coughs> what are you guys doing in there? Here, let's put this in the put this in the grooming drawer. Here we go. And we have another one here too. This is from Jack Cat. Is Jack Cat on? I'm not sure if Jack can't go on or not. Oh, it says Fragile Handle with Care. And Jack Cat, hey, we got your package today. And... Oh, now there's two of them. Now, I am not the computer person, but I understand... Wait a minute, now what did he tell me? Um, these are two... Five GHZs, is that what the Gerga, Gerga, yeah, Fire Wireless Access Point Bridge. Oh, yeah, now I remember what he said. This is what will help us to be able to extend, extend our gigahertz, gigahertz, that's what it is. This is what will help us extend our range so that we can, um, when we get this all set up, we can... Um, let you guys see in Kitty City and then next year when we do our concert outside that uh, you'll be able to see the concert live yourself and um, I'm not sure but I think he said it might even reach out to Cat's Cove when the cats go back out to the cove so Jack Cat these are awesome speed up to 15 times coverage up to 10 times avoids Interference. Six internal smart antennas maximize performance and range. Check out. This is awesome. Thank you so very much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm sure Kurt will know what to I know he knows what to do with these. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm learning more on the computer, though. Yeah. Jack Cat, you have a you have an in on on some of this computer stuff, huh? Oh, that's really nice. Yeah, good stuff, good stuff, Maynard. So we've got uh, uh, this card here is really special to me. Um, but I'm going to do this postcard. I love getting these postcards, and the cork board looks cool with these. This one is from Winchester. Isn't that beautiful? And this is from uh, Lauren H. And her webcam name is LT Holmes. 
It says, Dear FFRC, we're hooked on your webcam and so admire you what you do. Great work. Also love the chatters. Hugs to all of you and the kitties. And uh, so she's from Winchester. I have to use my cheat sheet again. Cat and cat will laugh at me. Massachusetts. So pretty cool. That's really cool. Thank you so much. Um, I'll add this to my... There we go. Greetings from Winchester, Massachusetts. Isn't that beautiful? Yeah, that's really nice. So, um, I'm just going to leave those two boxes from Jack Cat there, and I'm going to let Kurt handle all that stuff. That's your hometown Bantry? Cool. M.A., isn't M.A.? I've got a cheat sheet up here. Isn't M.A. Massachusetts? Yeah, M.A. is Massachusetts. Okay, this is a really special card. I think I showed you, um, her Her name is Hannah. This And Hannah, if you're on tonight, thank you so very much for your card. I love it. This is a little girl that lives in uh, Indiana that we chit chat. She's um, she has some medical issues that um, keeps her from being up up a whole lot. But she loves watching the webcam and the kitties. And uh, we try to send her quite. I try to do it at least once a month a card to her with our some pictures of the kitties here. I'd love to meet her sometime. I've told her mama that if she ever gets to. Um, get where she could be here in Defiance. We would love to have Hannah come. But check check this card out. I just got this today. It's full of stickers. I imagine Hannah put those all on on the back too. Pretty cool girl. And she wrote here, this is not really to me. This is to Weasley. So obviously Hannah likes Weasley. It says, uh, Dear Weasley, I like watching you on the kitty cam. I hope you have a nice Thanksgiving. Want, want you to know it's okay to cry because you are still a kitty and it is cute. Oh, so Weasley, it's okay if you cry. He says, I'm starting to get better about that, though. Hope you like the kitty stickers we used. Love, Hannah. Very, very cute. Hannah, if you're out there, thanks, Bunches. We'll get back with you again. Pretty cool. Look, check out all those. <laughs> Thanks, Anna. You're a pretty cool girl. And we'll hang your card up, too. And then... I did get this today, but the pictures um, are kind of small, so I'm not going to be able to show those. But it's from... Um, I got a letter from Patty. Patty is on his travels. It says... Dear Jackie, the Patty's here, and all friends at home. I thought I would try this new single thing called email. Everybody is talking about it, although I don't know how it works. I wanted to let you know that I am fine and really having a great time. I have seen so many things, old and new, that my head is spinning. Everyone has been so kind to me, and I have made lots of new friends, although I do miss you all, even Tugger. <laughs> I wonder if Tugger would miss Patty. I, I am off traveling again, not sure where my next stopover is, but I'm sure I will enjoy it and see more interesting things. Nan is not, now Nan is who has, um, has Patty right now, or at the time of this letter, which was, uh, I don't have it on here. Nan is not on Facebook, although she watches the cams and both type the day to help us win the shelter challenge. She is attaching some pictures of what I saw while staying with her in central Scotland. Perhaps perhaps we can put them up for everyone to see and we'll try to do that. Love and cuddles to all, Patty. Patty, I miss you. So she's got, um, Nan took pictures of um, her being with her cat and then it's going to Lenark, is it? Which is a royal bird whose charter was granted in 1140 A.D. There's a picture of that. There's a new Lenark, which was established as a mill town in the late 1700s. 
they spun and wove cotton imported from America. And then it, there's just pictures from all over, including Patty with Mrs. Claus. And then Patty writes, I didn't know anything about her, but she was very kind to me. And then the picture number eight says he's very tired and he's sunk down in a big old blankie sleeping. Uh, and another one where he's looking out the window at some bird feeders and you can see the birds on the feeder. And then, I'm not going to pronounce this right, but pictures 10 and 11 is that we went to a place called Chateau Pearl, which looked like a French chateau, but had been the hunting lodge for the Dukes of Hamilton. And then, these they are on Facebook now? Oh, that's awesome. He meant some Clydesdales, Clydesdale horses also. So you're saying these did get on Facebook? Okay, yeah, cool. Okay, that's cool. So they are on. Isn't that cool? These are, I'm saving these for Patty's um, box when he gets back here to us, too. Thank you. Thank you for this. And um, I didn't do questions since I was running late. Steve is off. He was off today, and I think tomorrow. Friday, the good news is, in case you haven't heard, he's got his third doctor appointment on Friday. So Friday, we have to go back to Lima for that third doctor's opinion of his knee. Um, but if there's any questions, I'll try not to miss any. About the injured goose, goose is taken care of. Um, we will open up our farmyard and welcome this goose. They have to try to uh, catch it first. Uh, it's called angel wings where the wings, instead of being able to be folded back along the body, they kind of flip up. We've had angel wing geese here before and they, they can't fly. So they're going to try to devise a way of um, cornering this goose and getting it here. It is a Canada goose, which means it is a protected goose, but it's not going to be caged. It will just be loose on the property and have free reign, just like all my other geese do. Lots of food and water everywhere. Um, Einstein is an eclectus parrot. I will give Sarah and Bella lots of love from you, Carolina. Um, let me see if I can catch any more. Thank you guys for your really nice words. Hey, who stepped on the mouse? You guys, that M M line mess has a big old picture in front. She must have stepped on the mouse, so I'm only reading parts. <laughs> What are you running short of in capital letters? Oh, litter, of course, but I know that that takes money to, to mail. Um, Mr. Clean we use, or Lysol. Well, Mr. Clean more than anything. Always stamps I run low on. Uh, paper towels I run low on all the time. Um, oh, gosh, my mind is a blank. Uh, Oh, the Clorox wipes I'm getting low on. The kitty um, grooming towels that we use for the faces I was getting low on. Where is Weasley at this very moment? I do not know. And I do not hear him whining. So he must be happy. I'll look. Check from pocket. Laundry. <laughs> yeah, I won't. I, I always do. Every night before I go to bed, I clean out my pockets. Um, whoops, I missed some. That's good. The goose is not going to be killed. No, they're going to try to catch it. Bella, and who is this one? Let me see your face. Preakness is on the sling, uh, is on the hammock already. Yeah, 232. Keep voting. We're going to hopefully win that $5,000 yet. Bella on the... i got to fix that what Emmeline did. Yeah, Bella's over here on the stool. Emmy, were you trying to mess with the... <laughs> I had to get my hair cut today. I always laugh because once I wash it, it'll be back to what it looked like before. <laughs> oh, well. Is it possible for us chatters to send Hannah cards? Hey, that's a, let me check with her mama. That Hannah probably would like that. Um, thank you, Chassie. For must love cats, yes, yeah, Cindy, Cindy sent in something for the must love cats for their new season that they're doing. 
fun visiting. Oh, I'm glad you guys came, Eric. I'm so glad you guys came. It was good. It was good to have you guys here. <laughs> How is it, Prilla? Um, you know what, Kitty Cam? That's the idea. Uh, that would be awesome. If you all want to do, like, Christmas cards and address them to Hannah, H-A-N-N-A-H, -H, put them in an envelope sent to the Rescue Center, I will compile them all together and send them to Hannah. Okay? And so if you want to do that, that... She would love that. I know she would love it. I know she watches the cam a lot. And uh, they send me pictures of her sometimes. She's the cutest little girl. Um, she's, I think she's nine. Uh, but that would be cool. Why are you not a featured? We are featured on Ustream. Yep, if you look, there's like nine of them featured at the top. I just checked it today and we're on it. Kitty's had turkey again today. I haven't heard from Cabas' family yet. If they don't call tomorrow, we'll chat. Uh, yeah, we, we were featured today again. Tugger did get adopted the day that I took him down to Uncle Eric. He was a, I did the official adoption two days later. <laughs> yeah, maybe that's why we haven't heard from Habas. Cabas, he's got his family in uh in the corner <laughs> yeah i could just imagine him running around i don't know i might have missed some some questions hi clem picks of lilo are great <laughs> how is sarah doing without her seizures we're just entering her 12th week of no seizures. That is awesome. That is it. You chewed the phone cord. That's the problem. We don't have a kitty named Hannah. I'll mark that down. I, I've got a slot on my desk. I'm keeping track of um, kitty names. So I will add that to that. Oh, April. I knew I missed one. Um... Aprilla is struggling. She had three days without any eating. She would not eat. Last week, waiter was probably a week ago, so I know she's less than that. She was 4.09 then. Um, I kind of made up my mind that I couldn't leave her go past this past weekend. Um, but yesterday, she started eating again. She's not eating the best, but she's not dehydrated. Um, the problem with... with uh, with um, Aprilia was, you guys have probably all heard her clear out here, she was crying and crying and it wasn't a painful cry, it was just like a um, a very sad cry, it made me want to, I just kept going in the house and holding her, but yet she didn't want me to hold her too much too tight, so I just sit and have her on my lap, um, but she did start eating yesterday again and today she ate maybe three little bits like this, so I'm going to we're going to keep keep going with her. Judy S. is here today. She Tomorrow she always eats good for Judy. So we'll see how she does tomorrow. She will not eat the baby food. Um, I did come out here, and I'm sorry, but I did take one of those packets of, uh, oh, those whiskers that have the gravy sensations, and she ate that. So I'm going to get some more of that tomorrow. But I wanted to see if she would eat that. So, um, hey, hi, Robin. Yeah, we'll keep trying on, on my acrylic girl. Do you have a chicken called Helen? I don't have a chicken called Helen. Aprilla, I we're not really sure. She's at least probably 13 years old at least. Any more of the, of the vitro? The vitro. You mean those little pills, Ohio? Oh, thank you, Nico Ross. can try that. I, I'm trying everything. Trust me, I'm trying everything on her. Yeah, thanks you guys. Oh, I didn't see your question about red dolls. I'm sorry, you want to run it by again? She didn't call it Connie. 
We lost another chicken yesterday, or last week. That I've got some that are so old out there. Aw, you guys are nice. Some special catnip pillows from Alaska? From, oh my gosh, directly from the seller. You should get them next week. That's cool. Hey, is it Lee? Lee, will you send me an email on that? So I can, I all you guys' notes that you send me about packages coming, I run them off and I tape them on my wall in front of me so I can keep track of that. Yeah, she's, she's not throwing up, so, um, although she's been a thrower up in the past, but she's not right now. What makes them a rag doll? I can answer that, but I have to go get something to look at, and then I have something else to tell you about another, whoops, um, about another rag doll, too. I'm glad you asked that because I meant to look this up today myself about the rag dolls because there's certain specific characteristics they say and I wanted to make sure I knew them right. Um, their ancestry is unclear. They don't have any other names. Their temperament is genial and relaxed. Their colors can be seal, chocolate, blue, or lilac. They can have mitted, their mitted colors are pointed colors with white. And they can come in chocolate, lilac, chocolate point. Their heads are medium to large with full cheeks and a rounded muzzle. Their eyes are large and oval, slightly slanted. Coat is medium length, thick and silky. Tail is long and bushy, slightly tapered. Their body is long and muscular with a broad chest. Their paws large, rounded, and tufted. Their neck is short and heavy set. I didn't realize that. Short and heavy set. Their legs are medium length with shorter fur than the body. And of course the paws again are large and rounded and tufted. A ragdoll head in profile, <clears throat> the face should have a, ge a very gentle break from the nose. Oh, I know what that is, which is of medium length, right? Well, I can't do it on me. The In profile, the face should have a very gentle break from the nose, which is of medium length. Yeah, it's right where the break comes up, where by the eye it should have a, have a break there. So I hope that answers. Um, it says here, although the Ray doll is a rel relatively new breed, its history is confused. Some people later bred her Ray dolls to produce the breed now accepted by major registries. The Ray doll success resulted from the demand for placid indoor cats. Similar breeds are being developed today, all with equally cozy names and some with equally bizarre claims about their traits. So, that's about it. We have another rave doll. Um, that's going to come back here. Her name is Sari, S-A-R-I. And this is this is funny because when I pulled this up today, it's like, wow, this cat was here a long time ago because this is what I used to use for my health records, not the really nice ones I use now. So she was born, the rig doll that's coming back is a tiger gray and white female. Her birthday is October 17th, 03. So she's, what is that, 9, 9, 10? Yeah, she was born in October. She arrived here in December. She, when she arrived, she had lice and fleas, upper respiratory infection. Nice kitty I have. We, we gave her her beginning vaccines, her spay, and then she was adopted in February '04. So she was a little a young youngster when she left here. She was probably almost four pounds. 
but she's coming back. This family uh, can no longer keep her. Not any bad reasons for um, the kitty. It has to do with a family member. So um, we're going to get her back. And I think she will be back tomorrow morning at 9 o'clock. The husband's going to bring her back. And, you know, I, <clears throat> I know that sometimes people <laughs> get upset that these families have to give them up and bring them back. But, you know, we all need to be grateful that they are bringing them back. Um, this family uh, is very torn up about having to have made this decision. And it is hard. You know, they've had her for years and years. But, you know, we have to always remember that a lot of these situations, um, yeah, uh, every family has crises that happens. And if they have to give them up, we want them to come back. So always never want to appear critical to the family because one it's hard enough to give them back up and two you know they're very sad it's they're very sad and, but they're also doing what the contract says bring them back here i want them to come back here always and i'm always so appreciative that when they can't do it they remember uh, that's why i like to send my newsletters out every year to all these families because in there i usually put a reminder in there you know don't don't forget, if, they, if you can't keep them, they have to come back here. So, um, yeah, Siri, S-A-R-I, will be back. Now, black and white. Some of you wanted to see. Yeah, you're right. You know, Siri's going to, it will be difficult for Siri. We're going to, I'm, I'm sure we'll put her right there in Dodger's pen or Patience's pen so she can kind of get an overview look at everything here and uh, kind of catch up that's a long time ago that she was here and boy this place did not look like what it does now let me show you a few of the black and whites and I'm gonna head in and uh, where oh where usually black and whites are everywhere I first off we'll test you guys anybody know who this one is you all know this one come here you silly it's it. Yeah, this is Burka. Burka's the one that shoulder rides. She's got that um, funny stripe up the nose with the black, black on the nose. This one I know you guys know too. Oh no, it's not Gonzo. It's Shasta. Yeah, this is Shasta. Yep. Shasta's kind of medium hair, and she's got that cute little black stripe up her black nose. And she purrs too. Oh, here now, you guys. I know know this one. Oh, she purrs! Yay! Gossamer got it. Oh, lots of you guys got it. I always say Jeepers has a on and off button right here, but he's he's a little bit bigger than some of the other babies. Oh boy, Angie's finding them all. Oh. You all know, get your big old tail out of the way, G. Know who this one is? Yep. This is Zelda. This is the one I'm going to kidnap someday. Zelda, when she first came in, if you all remember, she was skinny, skinny, skinny. And uh, she had those horrible wounds on her hips. Look at her. I do, too. I do, too, Diane. She's awesome. And she's got that, that cute little face. Let me, oh. oh, okay, who's this one? Check out her chin. <laughs> Octavia, Octavia, Octavia has, oops, here, just one more minute. She has no black on her nose, and she has the black circle under her chin. Here. Another one? Uh, there's probably at least maybe what four more know who this one is Gonzo you guys I'm telling you you guys are awesome yeah this is Gonzo Gonzo has the bigger fatter um, black blob on the face and Gonzo has a G under under her his tail <laughs> Somebody else asked me that. Are there really initials under there? And you know who this is, I'm sure. 
Add a gene. Add a gene is one of our um, <laughs> is one of our older oldsters. Yeah, that's her, and she's got the little cockeyed head. We love. Her. She's just utterly so patient and so she never asks for anything but love and uh, treats. And treats. Yeah, yeah. Ada Jean will look at you. It's, you know, she knows the volunteers who treat them. And she um, turns her head sideways and she opens her mouth. Nothing hardly ever comes out, but you can see her. And, oops, I gotta see who this is. Oh, yeah, who's this one? Awesome possum. Isn't he a handsome boy? And the water be turned on, that's right. Ada Jean will stand over by the sink and just steer you down so you turn that on. Yep. Awesome possum. Oh yeah. Some of these guys are hundred percent. Who's this one? Yep, we're finding them. Magenta. This is another one oh boy, I can feel her heart just a beating. Magenta. She was sleeping. Yeah. Yeah, she's she's uh, one of our oldsters. Yeah, we're missing a few more. Chaplin's got spunk to her. She's a little stink pot sometimes. And oh, thanks, Angie. And who's this one? Warren. Yep. That was Putter got somebody. You got it. This one's Warren. So now, if we put all black and white ones on on a page, would you guys know them all? Georgia. Yeah, we miss Georgia, Angie. Yeah. Um, she's got that part of that ring on her neck. Georgia. 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 Okay, yep, I don't see Georgia. Um she's a she's a hiding. All right, well, I'm going to clean up out here and Diane, I'll see you in the morning. Donna, you want to see Donna? Jeepers.
wish I could remember all those dates in my head, but I can't. Jeepers, it was born May 28th, and he arrived here October 1st. And, uh, yeah, Don, Donna is, is not black and white, but I'll show her to you. Oh. Oh. I love it sometimes when you pick up kitties when they're sleeping and their eyes roll back, back. <laughs> in their head. Aw, Donna says, what did you do to me? You woke me up. Can Bella get down from there? Oh, yeah, she can get down from higher places even. There's little Donna. She, she's just purring and purring. She really is cute. She's Her and... Uh, um, Weasley, oh my word, together they're just crazy. All right, let's go get you back to bed, bye. Excuse me, Yeah. Actually, I think um, somebody else knows that too. Okay. Excuse me, excuse me, excuse me, possum. Whoops, whoops, didn't mean to knock you down. 